a.m. here in McLean's. It is very busy. It's been busy since they opened at 7 a.m. <laughs> you McLean's? Nick, you should know where <laughs> yeah, I am. I am at McLean's. Deja's at McLean's. Fantastic breakfast spot. Good morning, before I forget, can you snag me a ham and cheese croissant and hang on to it? I'll be back in a couple of days. My name is Molly Lothman. Um, I'm one of the owners. My family owns McLean's Bakery and Markets. Um, we bought it about 10 years ago. I started working in restaurants when I was about 15 or 16, and I've, all, I've realized I've always loved um, hospitality, and specifically the food industry. It clicked one day how much I just enjoyed the process of providing just a small treat for people and how much that could change someone's entire day. Our entire goal at McLean's is making life somewhat sweeter. That is for our staff, that is for our employees, that is for everyone we interact with, from our vendors to everyone else. And so we always hope to give off that vibe of that we're here to just make life somewhat sweeter. You know, life is hard, everyone has things going on behind the scenes. And really, if we can just have one positive interaction with each guest and each employee who comes through the door, um, and just look for those opportunities, there's always opportunities out there to make someone's day just a a little bit better. My name is Cassidy Gar and my job title is Director of Guest Experience at McLean's Bakery and Markets. Coolest DM we've gotten on Instagram, probably from Beyonce. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> our social media team is made up of our graphic designer, me, Molly, and then our social media manager, Abby. Um, and so we're very collaborative. We're always working together um, to find out what's the next trend that's going on. What do we need to bounce on right now? So we're, I mean, we're always on social media. We're like chronically online, um, which fuels a lot of the creativity, pulling trends from TikTok and trends from Instagram going on. The importance of people supporting local businesses in Kansas City, I think, is so important. I didn't really understand it until I, you know, started my own small business here in Kansas City. But, you know, that way so much of the money just goes right back into Kansas City. Um, it really provides good working environments for locals here who, you know, high school students, college students who are, you know, trying to get their master's or something. But I think when people will put their money um, into local places here in Kansas City, we can continue to thrive. I think we've seen that in Kansas City over the last decade, with just all of the focus on Kansas City and you know even just like our sports teams doing well, that has a direct um, positive impact on, on McLean's even. Some of our busiest days are when we have Super Bowl days or things like that. With, with being in Kansas City since 1945, we harbor and um, have created so many memories and generational um, traditions for people. Um, the past 80 years. The fact that we get to be a place like that, the fact that we get to be a place where people say, I got my wedding cake here in the 70s and I got all of my children's birthday cakes here and, and they, they're getting their wedding cake here or their graduation cake here and, and their children are gonna, you know, we're just, we get to take care of and cherish all those memories that people have made. Always just trying to figure out, you know, every interaction it changes, but how can we leave um, our guests and also our coworkers better than we found them. Um, so that's a really important part about McLean's is making our swim sweeter. So I think that's why you should come to McLean's. <laughs>